Hi everyone, it's Andrew Algorithmic Trading Tools and Strategies and uh, finally, finally next week will be epic week and uh, I, I will share the, all my views like a few times I expected this market uh, uh, would uh, more reasonable and real because what uh, we're gonna have now is uh, like a mirage it's just it's it's unreal the market in con in comparison with uh, the whole like you know the civilization history that is what we're gonna have here this is a super pooper bubble which eventually will crash so i expected initially so that we will start the correction from this side but look, uh, I will show you a lot of uh, uh, interesting graphs and you can compare as I compare. And soon will be outcome really, really, really nasty. And uh, why you will know at, by the end of this, uh, watching this video to the end. So let's start. So this is SP500. Uh, in January, December, January 2022, this is the present time. What you can find uh, similar, first of all, this you know the crazy, uh, crazy move up of SP500, but that move was on money injections. So there are lots of money being injected and distributed to the shares right now what we have we have a huge money injection for the from the government side and baybacks but what's uh, could outcome from here will be a lot more nasty because that move it was when interest rates was so low so let's i will show you all this step by step uh, first of all, look, they stop. There is a crazy move up, almost non-stoppable, and uh, we finally they got this correction, and finally we'll got this correction after we moved on the next move up, and we got more here this next uh, leg up, but this leg already not as high as we had the previous one. So this is it is they reclaim this level, I reclaim this level. After why I can pay because the same people playing the same games. Only now financial conditions a lot more worse than previous ones. So this outcome it will be uh, really bad. It's like you know then they climb into the mountains and uh, sliding from the top of the mountains or like you're sliding from the middle of the mountain. Sliding from the top of the mountains, your speed will be a lot higher. And a lot more fun. So the fun ahead. South Korea on this week they going to send the people jail who searching shares of the uh, South Korean companies. This is a really you know like a real black swans. Government worrying about really bad nasty outcome. Really bad. So uh, you see there is a second top, second top, and. Uh, Finally, we'll get final top. And this top is just, you know, a flat also. Real, like it's a real, uh, some congestions and outcome. And as you can see here, the same, similar, it's forming. So it's forming. And that's with just a real similarity. That's what we're going to have and what we will have. So uh, look, the confirmation of me and uh, also you uh, think about also from that uh, point of view. We have uh, three stages of the market. The good news is the good news, they push the market up. The second stage is uh, bad news as a good news. That it could be uh, like expectation so this could be to so cut interest rates everything this will be so that so there will be better easy in the monetary part and uh, third stage the last one right now we're in the last one the bad news is a bad news 
And now the uh, traders started to realize because we got its really uh, bad uh, unemployment figures. And the market didn't really react like it was a react before. And on this graph, it's a weekly chart. Look, that's everything repeating three times. I don't know why, but it's maybe in the nature is our matrix. The matrix loves, you know, it's a free number, number three. So you see there is a three points, three tops. After uh, we have uh, almost three tops on the top. You know, that's also, you can count it's uh, three tops on the tops. Uh, the pattern repeating three times. You see, there's a one, two. That here, that's, that was a three, is just a mini copy of a previous copy. So there is a big copy, smaller copy, and mini copy. And finally, we're here. So that looks, there's a repetition, it's a three, three, three. Everything I remember it's mentioned about that's magical line and uh, because so many and every time it's known in the history if it's the trend like this bullish it's the always the goings down and now we have a in SP 500 like a GameStop uh, uh, company you know it's just a uh, GameStop it's collapsed exactly the same I expect in here and will be nasty collapse if you remember my previous forecast I thought it's the we will get the correction like this but no we already uh, some indexes in some countries we already in uh, a really big move down that's only the saving SP 500 from uh, hypes. You know, we have a, people still believe in AI. And for this, just compare another two charts. So this is a 2000 hype with a internet. And everybody, that's, I remember that time, it's everybody talked about the internet. And the Cisco company, like NVIDIA today with AI hype, provided uh, its uh, hardware for the uh, networking and the communication, that, its devices and what sort of uh, internet infrastructure. Exactly like now there is NVIDIA. And what's really interesting, so the company split it. Company split it. It was after split, a little bit high, and that was as a top of the SP 500. And the top, because that company, this company of the Cisco, it was quite, quite big in SP 500, exactly same like NVIDIA right now. And uh, that was the top of the uh, market uh, 2000 and after you know what's really happened the market collapsed and there was a really big collapse and also earnings the earnings before the split was just absolutely rosy and the earnings after not as rosy as before see there is this one standardized and the same story will happen here in nvidia because look there is just recently Intel actually reported, so they provided the chip that is really more uh, powerful than NVIDIA, but the market ignored it. Why? Because there's just, there are lots of uh, others already that companies put in video. But uh, when the market will start to collapse, then the plus and the plus the companies you know that it's profit of the companies if you look at the earnings expectation like like look uh just example apple look the earnings uh estimate 1.5 so the earnings which there's they reported a one dollar 53 per share what the next report one dollar 32 cents per share and the market on the top come on it's just uh, you know it's insane why because the ai you know they go into uh it's the embed the ai right now it's already ai in uh apple phone so what's the difference you know that's what's the difference in ai that 
and AI now is just will be more it's like it's integrated in the system but still there is not really many that's advantages of a mobile phone that mobile phone will not with AI will not make money for you it's just a device and the people expecting so it's just they buying the next model of AI it will be a like uh, Einstein brain embedded into the phone which is like a uh, giving you answer for all questions it's not it's just advanced search engine still it's not really big problem of AI it's still it's like a baby it's it's not on the stage which people actually expecting so that it's investing the all the data sensor when uh, the AI will start breaking the task on a subtask and dissolve every subtask and uh, eventually will come with a conclusions. No, it's just a copied information from internet and updated, adjusted the information to your request. That's it. It's not really creative person. It's adjustable. Make it's adjustable tool. It's adjusted the data which already somebody created, human beings created, and just adjusted data. And that's there's a result of AI. That's not a thinkable. It's just a, uh, collecting information. Okay, it's it can be good for you know it's uh, optimizing some process about, about art designers. But again, uh, look at the art which is AI. Yeah, it's creating. We can be like with six fingers. There's uh, arm or uh, hopefully there is no free eyes. You know, it's, but on, but yeah, look, there's a. Uh, AI generated pictures, they are not far away. They are far away from perfection. Some it's good, but you know, the 20% is just awful result. Again, so let's see, look, there is a hype with AI, Apple on the top. So that's all about right now hypes. And if you compare with the indexes, Dow Jones already just stopped growing, but some uh, indexes, look, Russell, look, the same story. Russell, it's the struggling. Struggling to go up in comparison with SPY. If we go to the indexes other countries. So this index of the uh, French CAC. This is CAC. So there is this index of the French the, the country already collapsed but we don't guys see here there's no result so far and if you look there's another index there is germany market you know this is really heavy plunge down but the uh, american sp500 stand in so i expected previously like this from here on my previous video i thought this uh uh, uh sp500 will uh, will make this uh, uh trend and this uh, move but it didn't really move from here so it was i was waiting uh, uh waiting until uh let's all get the confirmation and i have a uh, uh, lots of confirmations now there is a source of the money uh, the lots of it's uh, japanese yen with a carry trade and everything look what's happened now with japanese yen japanese yen it's all time high and uh look the volume pretty high and uh when it will break this uh, 160 yen for one dollar will be really bad outcome but it will come because it's still going high and higher high and higher because the central bank uh Japan, they stop, you know, intervening and uh, reduce all that's uh, QE. So this, the green one, is the Fed interest rates and uh, the in SP500. And uh, this 2007, look what was happened. When the interest rates was increased, the market, uh, yeah, this increased. But again, the leverage and uh, the the debt pressure here was three times easier less than here because the leverage this the debt the size of the debt here is three times bigger than here 
so uh when the interest rates this uh, uh that's on the staying on the same level interest rates staying on the same level the market usually comes to the uh up and suddenly so interest in june in J june uh it was still the same and uh in uh, august they started to cut interest rate and before they started to cut interest here this uh that's this uh, before we cut we had the first correctional wave down after the second and eventually the market collapsed with a collapse in interest rates and uh, right now we have inflation's a lot higher uh, than uh, in 2007 uh, that's the debt pressure a lot higher but the same behavior you see there is a flat and interest rate stop interest and uh, the market continues going up until so that's that's it started you know that's that's the pressure and what's the pressure is unemployment and unemployment actually started to grow and what's uh, another interesting uh, uh, for you graph so this is 2000 the same story see so there is a, on a flat interest rates even higher than uh, nowadays but you know it was 10 times less uh, the debt in the system in comparison to nowadays and again the market started they collapsed before the interest rate started to cut exactly the same what we have now so the, now the market will start to collapse and in september so there is a true uh lines this is um, in july and this meeting can this in september i uh, expecting it will come so this in july if we'll come to here uh will be no cuts why because cpi right now less uh, than previous one because the oil the energy prices dropped but now it's they recovered back again and the plus is a summer season there's a lot of demand for the uh, petrol and people travel so that will be the big demand which is also returning back the cpi higher so the fed will say oh sorry we we can do the nothing we'll wait september in september we should be somewhere here already and that september will start with cutting interest rates and the market could uh, uh, like make some uh, recovery rally because um, uh, interest uh, slightly cut it, but it was very short rally, uh, and uh, eventually it will collapse even more. So I expect in the, by the 25 and uh, exactly repeating it's 2008. It's uh, regardless of the election, which is also 2008 elections, and here and uh, how that's the uh, market reacting so something combination between uh, 2000 and uh, 2008 uh, that's uh, we expecting on the market so from interest rates now it's let get uh, back to inf uh, to the labor market so as you can see uh, recently we have uh, from 2024 we have uh, unemployment going high and higher last time we had similar in may june 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 and this it is always june and july but now we we don't have uh, like a move up it will be still this uh, will go high and higher and uh, remember what it was here there's uh, the high unemployment scared the market it was slightly correction but what's uh, really uh, that's happened later and I already mentioned uh, because 10 years the government bonds which is really f uh, f uh, fixed investment but uh, free from uh, all the losses like fixed 5% interest rates it was October so when the market started to uh, correct or not collapse correct collapse coming so it started to get uh, this correction 
there are lots of investors this uh, invested money they took from a share market and invested into uh, uh, 10 years American bonds and that's all investment because the more the money invested there will be a higher uh, the price of uh, uh, 10 years the uh, bonds but the uh, lower interest rates and that's there is a corrected to here to three percent and in December and uh, Jerome Powell and company they realized oh wow inflation disappeared so everything uh, beautiful and rosy so that's why it's actually this uh, and but the, the my forecast so you see there is a bullish flag I expect a bullish flag not a bearish people thinking there no I think we will break all this 10 years there's never ever uh, have a, a lonely top all this the top double or even will be a high than over top but i expect it will be the 10 years will be over that top because it will be uh, the huge uh, debt deficit and it's growing and growing so that's that will be uh, risky investing into the uh, america it will be more risky so that will be more at the high premium so I think it will be more than this we will go in soon very soon and uh, so what's happened with uh, SPY so the SPY was rallying and this is non-stop rally of the hopes and the plus EI so the EI I showed this already with the Cisco company the same outcome will be same with nvidia but uh, look what's the nvidia nvidia right now like a rocket into the skies and um, usually the zigzag it's almost double so if uh, that's equal price so if we'll start with this one from here this we started zigzag or oh, but we, even we have a correct the leg which is uh, the break so we'll start to measure this one so this one is a one leg and this one is another leg so almost already equal so equal legs so there's uh, and video also already exhausted to climb higher and this actually in video only the drug the like trillion company the drug Apple already done there is a manipulation this person own the shares just to lift the price and sell all of its uh, uh, funds on the top the shares is uh, like very common manipulation already on the top so finally we returning back to SPY do you think we will go higher lots of my uh, subscribers they thinking so will go in higher but will be really really unexpected uh, outcome for them especially for newbies so thinking like a binary dips easy when you moving up it's like you uh, uh climbing by the, it's the stairs so like step 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 but here you'll take a lift oops and very quickly you'll be at the ground floor again so that's my probability still and i'm 100 percent sure so that any like people say oh i predicted here the top and it didn't materialize and it here this was stop not materialized here they stop it was correction but it's not really like it's moved moving down here I was also said this one stop again it's very hard to find where they stop but the this one is all mirage it's just uh, disconnected from the uh, whole economy and Warren Buffett laughing they're looking at this graph and I gave you lots of uh, evidences of this the end we uh, from here we'll get some substantially high like a six thousand and else there's, there's there's no drive you know the one uh index that will not go up the data is going bad even now it's uh, bad news becomes bad news even some of them they're trying to uh purchase all the correction but uh smart 
investors that purchase in uh, selling selling uh, uh, to the retailers and uh, that says all distribution it was distribution here pretty good here and now it's here and here and also they taking in account the big whales financial they need to negotiate this uh, the trading strategy and negotiation that this always on a weekend so if they can it's all this it's inside information manipulation it's always in the market you know it's hidden because it will be punished with a uh, uh, very it's uh, badly but by law but it's only based on it finally i forgot it's for uh non-commercial net positions on sp500 look there's people betting on that the price will go down and last time the same bet it was in the beginning of april remember what was in april that's the market collapse so that's uh the smart money positioning now it's the, the short and it's the numbers of the shots increased for this week as well as the previous week as well as well starting from april so that's a smart money positioning to share it at uh, the short if you look what we expect on the uh, next coming week pmi it's also uh really surprised with a pmi look this kind of a indicator how the business growing so that's so you see this from uh, october 2022 there is no growth in uh, uh, in the businesses it's only ai did you see this something uh, so bad before no almost the coming information data which is in this system we don't have this it's only had the pmi in april like they'll crash but look it was was a little bit improvement and now it's back going back again to the zero and negative and it's really also the warning indicator so the unemployment pmi so their business is not growing uh unemployment now it's growing uh debt a record high plus so this is it hope you enjoy this long video but the lots of information i share with you and all the best and uh, keep subscribing i will also demonstrate my robot which is now it's really that's it's better than many ai integrated robots for trading and because the principles principles of the robot are unique are very unique so you watched how the robot trading and results you'll publish it it's also the next video as well so enjoy uh, your holidays bye